The Simple Minds Hurdle is next then, and this is a three mile hurdle. And I've seen to a few of these this week. It's a three mile maiden hurdle, and the top one is Captain for David Hooley, Heartbreak Hotel for Paul Rhodes, Cirque for Marty Liam, Sparrow Berry for Darren Thompson, Vimiero Donny, no, Vimiero, uh, start try that one again, Vimiero Dominee for Thomas Rogers, Been About Look for Craig Allen, Breakout Leon Van Rensburg, Hyacinth Calapa, Darren Thompson, Jay's Doll Stall, James Shea, Karminsky Pont for Graham Clutterbuck, Need to Improve Craig Beckwith, Return of the Ghost Joshua Southern, Southwark Sociable for David Robertson, and Two to Lose and Trode Bow for Ryan Tamasevi, so what are two interesting names in that lot, they're away and racing, and this is a novice three miler as well, so it's Captain who's gone off into the lead, thank goodness that one's got a sensible sort of easy name to say, there's one or two tongue twisters in this one, and Captain's in the lead, and Heartbreak Hotel on the inside in second, so those two at the moment have pulled themselves clear of the remainder, so they're out on Lonely Street on their own with Karminsky Pont in third, then two to lose, and Ryan Tavasabi will be hoping he hasn't got two to lose in this because he's got two runners in it. The other one's called Trade Bow as they take the first flight eventually. And looks like one or two of the horses may be put off by my bad puns and made mistakes. So Captain's in the lead then from Heartbreak Hotel second. And a gap of a good five or six lengths then to Jay's Doll Stall who's third. Cirque on the inside is four. Then comes two to lose and Trade Bow. The stable mates together as they skip over flight number two. And they are well strung out already. Captain is still in a strong pace here. And Heartbreak Hotel is now three lengths adrift off him in second, but still three or four lengths ahead of Jay's Doll Stall, who's the horse in third. Then two to lose is four, and Trade Bow is five. And there's a line of about seven or eight of them all pretty much together, and a couple out the back who are not in shot, but it's Captain in the lead. With Heartbreak Hotel in second. I'm not sure that jockey's got a blue suede cap, or blue suede shoes, but he's definitely got a blue cap. Have a look at the back of Vimiero Domini. He's the back marker. And the one that's really dropped back is Cirque. It was up there in about third a couple of minutes ago, and now it's right out the back with Breakout. Just taking a share of the last but one spot as they take the third, which is up the straight and will be the second last next time round. As you can see, they are very well strung out as they take the fourth. And Captain is in the lead. Heartbreak Hotel is second. Two to lose is third. And Jay's Doll Stall is after that one. Make their way past the stand, past the winning post. One more circuit to go. Try to think how far behind the ones at the back will be. They carry on like this because there's a long way between first and last at this point. And Captain, I'm not going to keep up this pace. Heartbreak Hotel is in hot pursuit in second. We see them racing away from us. Could be setting the race up for closers, I think. It's always worth taking into account, but we've seen one or two of them today and this season so far getting off into the lead and staying there. And David Hooley will be hoping that Captain is one of them. And Paul Rhodes will be hoping that his Heartbreak Hotel can take it. And Captain made a mistake at that one. It's not going to have done it a lot of good. And Sir and Vimiero Domini will they might as well pull up, I think, because they both look to be going really badly at this point. I'm not quite sure there's anything amiss with a lot of them, but they're quite a long way away. Cirque is being scrubbed right along. Don't seem to be the slightest bit interested in racing at all today. But it's Captain and Heartbreak Hotel who are disputing the lead. They're a good six or seven lengths clear of two to lose. And then Trode Boat. And Hyacinth Calapa is after that one. The grey is Southwark Sociable. Coming around the outside in chase. Oh, I either need to improve or sparrow berry, whichever one of them isn't the grey one, in the same colours. Well, it's Heartbreak Hotel now, just about in front. Captain, though, being driven back up on the inside to regain the initiative. And Captain, it is, is going to lead in to the third last, I think. 
wherever they go, but I better jump again. By Heartbreak Hotel, who's gone on by length. Captain is second. The field are beginning to close. Karminski Pont is making a good a good run as moved into third. Then two to lose, and Jay's Doll Stall is next. Then Trode Bow. Then come the two greys there, Southern Sociable and Return of the Ghost. They're trying to get into it now, it's Breakout coming there with a run, is Hyacinth Kalapa. And suddenly the race is wide open and maybe those two did go off a little bit too quick. Because Heartbreak Hotel is now being collared by Karminski Pont and Karminski Pont has taken it up. Karminski Pont has hit the front and is immediately being chased by Southern Sociable on the outside. The two early leaders, Heartbreak Hotel and Captain are now under pressure. Two to lose, he's trying to come round the outside but they're coming down towards the final two flights in there and Karminski Pont is in the lead by about three quarters of a length to Southwark Sociable in second Heartbreak Hotel trying to stick on in there two to lose is running on on the outside it's probably between these as they come into the final two furlongs over the second last they go and it's Southwark Sociable just about in the lead from Karminski Point and two to lose. Sirk's been pulled up. It's Southwark Sociable in the lead. Southwark Sociable goes about a length clear. They've got one more flight to take. Southwark Sociable jumps it slowly. A better jump by two to lose. And two to lose could be one to win. It's two to lose on the outside from Southwark Sociable on the near side. It's going to be a head bobber as they race up towards the line. The Greys just beginning to get up. And it's Southwark Sociable that takes it. Two to lose. His second breakout is third. Karminski Pont was after that one. And the field will trail back to Viniero Domini, who was right out the back. And Cirque has caught the bus home, I think. At um, Southwark Sociable in a head bobber with two to lose. Breakout was third. No, it wasn't. It wasn't says breakout there, but it was definitely not. Oh, it might have been. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> disappeared there for a second break out I think what he was there well so anyway we'll get back, back to sensibility Southwark Sociable the winner for David Robertson two to lose for Ryan Tower 72nd break out for Leon Van Rensburg was indeed third Karminski Pont for Graham Clutterbuck was fourth and Trode Bow for Ryan Tamasebi was fifth <laughs>